board is sterile here to try to minimize the chance of infection. Spinal cord stimulation is a is a device that's been around since the uh, the late 60s, uh, but with uh, increasing technology, uh, battery technology is allowing uh, us to implant these devices. And kind of like you might see in some uh, news media venues, is these things being called uh, pacemakers for pain. And what this does is it causes a paresthesia in the spinal cord and basically replaces the pain pathways that the patient had before. What we're doing today is called a spinal cord stimulator trial. We're going to be placing two electrodes that are about the size of fishing line, actually, with iridium and platinum tips here. And these electrodes, actually, once they're connected to a battery device, will actually uh, give these impulses to the spinal cord and actually mask these pain and actually completely, a patient on the table more than likely is going to say, hey, look, you know, you got my pain completely covered. I could shock whatever I need to. I could actually uh, um, recreate any pain distribution across the body, whether it's the left leg, right leg, back, neck, like this kid today. He has a failed back surgery syndrome. 70% of his pain is back pain, and another 30% is leg pain, ridiculous pain. He's, this guy has had four back surgeries, okay, at probably about 100 grand a pop. What is going on with your back? Yeah, okay. Feel even on both sides? Sir? Yeah. Okay, sir, tell us when you feel something. Okay. Feel it now? Okay, where do you feel the stimulation? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 